Why isn't my dog Jewish if he's part of my Jewish family? Well, I'll start by saying that being a religion or being a part of a religion is a human thing. No animals belong to a religion. So when I say that my dog isn't Jewish, that's what I mean. Does my dog have to follow Jewish laws that we follow, like any of the kosher laws? No, and a little bit yes. His dog food does not need to be kosher. When I buy dog treats, they do not need a kosher certification on them. Do I avoid buying him treats that have bacon in them because bacon isn't kosher and I don't wanna bring bacon to my home? Yes. But at the end of the day, he's a dog eating it. So like if he goes to daycare and they give him a bacon treat, he's not going against Torah law. The only time that we have to be careful about the kosher food we give to our animals is Passover time. Because the laws are very strict during Passover or Pesach about certain things we eat, like nothing that is leavened or anything with grains, we avoid giving our dogs grain food over Pesach. Louis eats grain for a year round, so we don't have to switch things up over the holiday. But there are some people who will give their dogs grain-free food over Pesach. But besides that, Louis isn't a Jewish dog just because he's part of a Jewish family. If he turns 13, will we give him a bark mitzvah? I don't know. We'll get there when we get there. But it's certainly not mandatory. A bark mitzvah is more of a fun, joking kind of thing. It's not real. He won't suddenly be responsible for his own commandments.